A little boy who never saw his second birthday and his case never made it to court. On the 21st of April 2013, Sam Harry was found unresponsive in his home in Brumham in Bedfordshire. When he was rushed to hospital, doctors found Sam had suffered a significant head injury comparable to being in a car crash. A few days later, Sam died. His mother, Deanna, and her boyfriend, Ryan Bate, were arrested on suspicion of murder, but the CPS decided there was not enough evidence to prosecute either of them. Today, both of them appeared at an inquest into the toddler's death. In court, the coroner asked Sam's mother, Deanna, was it you who left that fatal injury? She replied, no. He said, was it Mr Bate? She said, I assume so. The same question to Mr Bate, was it you? He said, no, it follows suit, it was D. Recording a verdict of unlawful killing, the coroner said the couple did know what had happened to Sam, but said they had failed to come forward with that account. He said both Deanna and Ryan didn't know the difference between the truth and a lie. Sam's dad, Nick Harry, says he's here to represent his son. Obviously, he can't be, he can't be here himself, so me and my family will, will always represent him and we'll always do our best by him. Um, it's by no means the end in, in our eyes. Um, we'll just continue pushing and pushing and pushing until something or someone cracks. As the inquest here closes, police say the case to find out what happened to Sam remains open. Frankie McCamley, 5 News.